Today's question has come from Shankar from Chennai who wants to know how many mock test series for CAT should he enroll for? Shankar, right now with more than four months to go for the CAT examination, ideally start with one mock series of any leading coaching institute. They would provide somewhere around 20 to 25 mocks. Use each one of them, analyze them very well. So after each exam you take, spend at least one and a half hours, maybe two hours to analyze the examination, your performance, what you would have done if you were to take this exam again for you know the same paper again. So then look at pitfalls, go back to the things that you have learned, look at things which you need to learn more and look at the uh, questions which you got uh, wrong, why it went wrong, go back and do the correction process. So that is how you do the analysis. So that is extremely important. It's not the number of marks that you take because you have 20 to 25 marks in any uh, mock test series, let's say 25, plus you have the real time 15 actual CAT papers from 2017 waiting for you, which you should be using uh, during the final phase of the preparation uh, for the CAT examination uh, sometime after uh, uh, September. So uh, that's during the final run. That is. So you have 25 plus 15, 40 marks uh, ready for you. So what cannot be done with 40 cannot be done with 60, isn't it? So uh, analyzing your performance using the mock test series that you have enrolled for or you want to enroll for is the most important thing. And then in case you complete all the uh, topics thoroughly by say September and early October, then you want to then test yourself using more, uh, you know, actual uh, uh, you know, CAD papers or now, let's say exams like mocks which mirror the CAT examination, then you enroll for another uh, mock series and then take the test again to review your performance and then to go back and work on areas where you need to improve on so that you do well in the CAT examination. Now, of course, coaching institutes are going to tell you that you need to take uh, two mock series and all that. They are bound to say that, isn't it? Because when they push two mock series, then they are in the hope that at least one of them uh, would be their mock, which should be chosen by the students. So the chances of them getting more students, more good students and more good students converts to uh, more uh, results, which they can tout and all that kind of thing. So that is the marketing part. Uh, leave that and focus on things that you have to do. That is your preparation. So use the mock series that you have enrolled for analyzing each paper as you go along and improving on your uh, preparation, which will result in improved uh, performance and you will do well in the CAT examination. Mm -hmm.